the music's overture to Rienzi by Wagner, his opera uh, to Cola di Rienzi, composed around uh, 1840. It was Wagner's first great uh, success. It made him world famous, and this opera became just uh, very famous in 19th century about this uh, Italian statesman hero. And uh, he has unusual reputation because Hitler is said to have uh, had his revelation of political mission uh, when he listened to this music as a teenager with his friend, when he received a revelation to unite all the Germanic peoples and so forth. So, you know, this uh, opera then became untouchable by some. But it remained a very popular piece nevertheless in the 19th and 20th century. But so uh, Wagner, he based this opera on a novel called Cola di Rienzo, The Last of the Roman Tribunes by Edward bulwer lytton who was a British statesman and novelist, a very colorful life. And this same Edward bulwer lytton is actually the author of another novel called Vril, The Power of the Coming Race that he wrote in the 1870s, which deals with an ancient race of power beings and the problem of hollow earth. I may have mentioned on this show before, but uh, this novel by bulwer lytton Vril, about inner earth, hollow earth, it became very important for theosophists and uh, later for hippies of the type, um, for esoteric Hitlerists, right? This kind of hippie. So now you can outsource this problem to a Jessica Nobody Berg feminist lesbian, who, uh, somebody who does critical studies, academic, to talk about the nexus of literature and music important for neo-Nazis, and to make a spaghetti chart conspiracy connections, perhaps between political populism and real hollow earth legends of Agartha. This is possible, but uh, you know, I don't think actually there's any connection between these two things. It's just a bore lighten uh, was what you might call politically a uh, classical liberal, maybe. And Cola di Rienzo is just an exotic and unusual great man, elusive in many ways, hard to understand. So then you can uh, see how he would be very attractive for connoisseurs of the exotic. 